ಅಸ್ಮದಾಚಾರ್ಯಪರ್ಯಂತಾ ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪರಂಪರಾ ಐ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಆಲ್ ದ ಡಿವೋಟೀಸ್ ಡಿಸೈಪಲ್ಸ್ ಸರ್ವಜ್ಞಪೀಠ ಯಜಮಾನ್ ಸಮಾಜಿ ಸತ್ಸಂಗೀಸ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಒನ್ ತನೇದಾರ್ ಮಹನ್ಸ್ ಕೊಟಾರಿ ಸಿಟಿಂಗ್ ವಿತ್ ಅಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಓವರ್ ದ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಎಸ್ಟರ್ಡೆ ಸತ್ಸಂಗ್ ಐ ಮೇಡ್ ಅ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಟು ಆಲ್ ಮೈ ಡಿಸೈಪಲ್ಸ್ ದೌ ಶೆಲ್ ನಾಟ್ ಡೂ ಎನಿ ಸ್ಪಿರಿಚುವಲ್ ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸ್ ಮೆನಿ ಪೀಪಲ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಆಸ್ಕಿಂಗ್ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಸ್ಟಾಪ್ ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಯೋಗ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಟಾ ಸ್ಟಾಪ್ ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಡೇ ಶಿವ ಪೂಜಾ ಲಿಸನ್ ಇನ್ಕ್ಲೂಡಿಂಗ್ ಯೋಗ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಶಿವ ಪೂಜಾ ಯು ವಿಲ್ ನಾಟ್ ಡೂ ಸ್ಪಿರಿಚುವಲ್ ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸ್ ಲಿಸನ್ ಕೇರ್ಫುಲಿ ಡೂ ಯೋಗ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಶಿವ ಪೂಜಾ ಟು ಮ್ಯಾನಿಫೆಸ್ಟ್ ದ ಪವರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಅ ಸ್ಪಿರಿಚುವಲ್ ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸ್ if you are doing shiva puja as a spiritual practice to demand something from sada shiva he may come but feeling oh god again this fellow i have to see him his face he will ask for some stupid things do it as manifestation of sada shiva in you do shiva puja to manifest sada shiva in you seeing sada shiva in the deity is nothing but you training yourself to manifest sada shiva wherever you want if you can manifest him in the deity you can manifest him wherever you want understand even shiva puja is only to manifest powers experiences not as spiritual practice do yoga to manifest all the spiritual powers from inside which has been put inside you as a seed in shuddha advaitam at least after inner awakening program thou shall not do any spiritual practice because the inner awakening itself i put all the seeds inside you just need to manifest 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 understand the whole puja is nothing but method way of manifesting sada shiva sit with the tremendous declaration the cosmic source from which everything is living let it manifest here let it accept this offerings let you manifest in my life continuously with all your experiences and powers glory understand the mentality you carry is you supreme mental setup a supreme thought current is what i am teaching you have this supreme thought current
whether you do yoga, even while you do yoga, tell yourself very clearly, the powers and seed is inside, let it start manifesting. Let it start manifesting. Supreme powers Supreme experiences, the greatest oneness, understand in thinking, talking, walking, living in every step, in every step. Go on manifesting, manifesting, manifesting. All the spiritual practices you do, do it only for manifesting. If you think they are spiritual practices, don't do. Do it only for manifesting. Only from the context of manifesting, understanding of manifesting, it should be practiced. Everything you do in your life should be for manifesting this extraordinary powers and experiences. The thought current the Shanti Pata reveals May the sacred truths declared in Upanishads fully manifest and radiate in me as sacred experiences, sacred powers and sacred sentiments who am integrated and authentically devoted to knowing and experiencing the truth, the Atma, the Self, Tatatmani, Nirateya, Upanishad Su Dharmaste, Mayi Santu, Te Mayi Santu. Recite the mantra, Shanti Mantra, Shanti Pata, along with me. Om. Apyayantu mamangani Vak pranaha Chakshushrotraha Matobalam indriyani cha Sarvani Sarvam Brahmaopanishatam Maham Brahmanirakuriyam Mama Brahmanirakarot Anirakaranamastva Nirakaranam me astu Tatatmani Nirateya Upanishatsu Dharmaste Mayi Santu Te Mayi Santu The thought current, this Shanti Pata shares with all of us is declare through your will to integrate yourself and 
manifest the supreme consciousness brahman manifest all the sacred experiences sacred sentiments sacred powers with this shanti mantra with this declaration peace declaration let's enter into the first verse of the upanishad shanti mantra is mostly considered as introduction because sometime few upanishads use same shanti mantra same shanti paata so this verse is considered more like a introduction now listen and recite the first verse along with me keneshitam patati preshitam manaha kena pranaha pratama praiti yuktaha ಕೇಶಿತಂ ವಾಸಿ ಮಾಂ ವದಂತಿ ಚಕ್ಷುಶ್ರೋತ್ರ ಕವುದೇವ ಯುನಕ್ತಿ ರಿಸೈಟ್ ಒನ್ಸ್ ಮೋರ್ ಕೇಶಿತ ಪತತಿ ಪ್ರೇಷಿತ ಮನಃ ಕೇನ ಪ್ರಾಣ ಪ್ರಥಮ ಪ್ರೈತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಕೇಶಿತ ವಾಸಿ ಮಾಂ ವದಂತಿ ಚಕ್ಷುಶ್ರೋತ್ರ ಕವುದೇವ ಯುನಕ್ತಿ beautiful verse the translation is by whom willed and caused does the mind go towards its object by whom willed and caused and directed and united with which does the first vital life energy the chief cause comes forth towards its, its activities at whose will does this speech gets activated and speaks enlivened and directed by what luminous divine power indeed do the eyes and the ears engage in their functions first and foremost sacred action seeking it is only when you start seeking the truth your spiritual journey starts till then whatever you are doing can be entertainment good entertainment can be called as good entertainment not spirituality we 
with seeking spiritual practice starts with the right guru's inca initiation spiritual practices end the moment i initiate you after that whatever you do is only manifesting not initiation केनेशि पथति प्रेषि मन कें प्राण प्रथम प्रैति युक्त केनेशिता वाच मीमा वदी चक्षुश्रोत्रंगवुदेव युनक्ति सीकिंग बै हूम विल्ड एंड कास्ट डज द मैंड गो टुवर्ड्स इट्स आबजेक्ट by whom directed and united with which does the first vital life energy the chief cause comes forth towards it, its activities at whose will does the speech gets activated and speaks enlivened and directed by what luminous divine power indeed do the eyes and the ears engage in their functions seeking coming to the fundamental basic questions coming to the fundamental basic questions understand whenever something fails in your life whenever you are not manifesting something as you want the first thing you need to do is come to question the fundamentals come and start questioning the fundamentals touch up will never solve the issues maybe it will make up and make it look like you made it for others listen for others to look like you made it is different you making it is different are you interested in others feeling you made it or are you interested in you making it whenever things fail things are not working out as fundamental questions don't be afraid if you ask fundamental questions some of the skill sets you acquired some of the plans you made some of the road through which you traveled may all will become redundant irrelevant you may have to undo them you may have to remove them from your life it may even cost you it may even cost you that is okay ability to have the fundamental questions again and again and abide by the seeking is renunciation whenever you fail go and ask the fundamental questions reorganize yourself reinvent yourself rejuvenate yourself without the fear of burning some part of you dropping some part of you removing some part of you that that guts that courage is what i call rudra ability to reinvent yourself is rudra 
usually during the maintenance you forget your goal and ac acquire luxurious frills inauthenticity frills again and again or at least whenever you face failure ask the fundamental questions that will remove the inauthenticity gathered around you that will remove the inauthenticity you created around you ability to go on removing the inauthenticity is gathering around you is rudra in brahma vishnu rudra brahma creates vishnu maintains rudra rejuvenates rejuvenation means ability to reinvent yourself by coming to the fundamental questions of life seeking coming to the basic questions of life seeking ke neshitam patati preshitam mana kena prana prathama praiti yuktah ke neshitam va samimam vadanti chakshu srotram kadeva kavu deva yunakti by whom willed and cast does the mind go towards things its object by whom directed and united with which does the first vital life energy the chief cast comes forth towards it its activities at whose will does the speech gets activated and speak enlivened and directed by what luminous divine power indeed do the eyes and the ears engage in their functions for any problem solution is not asking superficial questions if you ask superficial questions and fix the problem you may be doing temporary maintenance you may be doing breakdown maintenance and you will continue to do breakdown maintenance you will continue to do breakdown maintenance you will continue to do crisis management ask the fundamental questions ask the fundamental questions by asking fundamental questions if you reinvent yourself if you rejuvenate yourself if you reactivate yourself if you rededicate yourself to the truth you will solve the problems from the core you will solve the problems from the core all the solutions comes out of the core all the solutions comes out of the core will be eternal if your business is not working don't try to ask what is happening to my business ask what is happening to me am i interested in what i am doing 
Am I passionate about what I am doing? Am I really into what I am doing? Kene shitam patati preshitam manakena prana pratama praiti yuktaha. The Upanishad starts with the fundamental questions. If something does not work out in your life, start asking fundamental questions. Raise fundamental questions. I give you twenty-four hours time. Look into your life. Whichever part is not working, don't try to solve that part. You can't retain two diseases and heal one disease. You can't retain two diseases and cure one disease. Understand? You can't retain two problem and solve one problem. No, life doesn't work that way. Maybe your psychiatrists work that way. Maybe your doctors work that way. But life does not work that way. Life is whole. Solutions come only when you ask fundamental questions of life. Ask fundamental questions. Whenever something does not work, ask, what am I? Who am I? In what am I interested? What makes me alive? What gives me inspiration? What makes me active? What raises me to my peak? Ask fundamental questions. Ask fundamental questions. Only that will solve the problems permanently, eternally. The more you ask the fundamental questions, more you will build a powerful foundation for life. Powerful foundation for Sadashiva to manifest through you. Powerful foundation for the divine expression. Ask fundamental questions. That will only solve your problems and create the foundation from which you can go on manifesting and growing. Twenty-four hours to ask fundamental questions, then come back to understand the deeper truths about seeking. The first verse of Kano Upanishad, Kene shitam patati preshitam mana kena prana pratama praiti yuktaha kene shitam vachamimam vadanti chakshushrotram kavudevo yunakti. With this, I bless you all. Let you all radiate with integrity, authenticity, responsibility, enriching, causing, living, shuddhat vaita saivam, the eternal bliss, nityananda. Thank you. Be blissful.